What's up gamers, it's your boy Rox T to the V, and today we're talking about the main beef between the best, one of, if not the best, rappers of all time, versus Drake. <laughs> Basically, I'm a really big Kendrick fan. I've seen Kendrick live. It was a touching moment in my life, and I'm like, I was there like Danny DeVito, watching Mac dance, or fucking whatever, and man, like, I get it now. Because that was a fucking insane experience. The person I've been following since I was 12 years old, finally seeing him live. I mean, it was his birthday. He wasn't really into it as much as I wanted him to be. So I was kind of like, dang, cringy, why, why? And it kind of like seems like it was just up there to get it done with. But still, I can't hate on him for how good he is at what he does. The best, in my opinion, the best. And then there's the rest, my favorite rapper. And then you have Drake, who I enjoy back in the day, you know, like started from the bottom, now I'm here, you know, or like, Joji's version started, got it in the bottom now. Q. Uh, <laughs> that version of it, which, you know, Pink Guy, great artist himself, but, you know, I, I feel like Drake's just become cheesy. You know, he's become a meme, which I really enjoy just making fun of him. Whenever I hear Drake, I'm like, Drake! It's a funny meme. Funny meme nowadays, but, like the DJ Khaled memes, but I have no respect for Drake. And really, Today, Drake released a fucking response, another diss track, the Kendrick diss track, which basically Kendrick's diss track called Drake a pedophile, basically, and Drake defended himself by saying, you got molested. <laughs> that's why you mad, man. You got molested. That's why you mad. I'm in a mansion, fucking little kids in the gonads. Basically what Drake said. He basically said, why am I, in, if I'm a pedophile, why, why aren't I in jail? Why am I, you know, because all the fucking rich, powerful, famous people who have done things to minors are in jail. Not those. Uh, but, I mean, I, I kind of believe Kendrick. You know, it, this, this fucking diss tracks, this beef started off with Kendrick Bezos saying, I'm number one, I'm the best rapper, you know, J. Cole, Drake, they fucking, they fucking trash, you know. And Drake responded with basically, you're small, you're ugly, you ain't got no hoes. And then J. Cole is over here sipping fucking margaritas, just chilling in you know, some beach paradise somewhere, living his life. And I respect J. Cole for doing that, for apologizing that 100%. He won. I think J. Cole won the fucking battle, right? Because he didn't have to do anything. He doesn't have to get like his fucking, like Drake's, Drake's getting like, fuck, dude, it, he's getting backshot like crazy. Like, the Drake backshots are going crazy right now. Pause. That's, that's insane what I just said. Anyway, then Kendrick fucking came back fucking swinging, basically saying, fuck you, Drake, kill yourself. <laughs> and then dropped another one, and then Drake said, okay, I'm coming back. You beat your fucking wife, which I don't think is true. And then Kendrick said, okay, cool. 20 minutes later, let me drop another one. And basically saying, you got a daughter, you have people in your organization who are leakers who don't like you your ghost riders fucking suck and i'm gonna do it all in a fucking like great song and then drop another one the same night later that night with one of the best fucking sounding like one of the best songs of 2024 probably the best song of 2024 at this point and then drake responds today from that response drake uh kendra did that as i said you're a pedophile and you have pedophiles around you and Drake said, uh uh, nah uh. How could I be pedophile? I'm a certified lover boy. Yeah, yeah. Which I'm gonna get on, on a quick tangent, real quick. You can skip ahead. I'm, I, I just had to get this out here. Drake, be weird with me, man. If you are a pedophile, which I see the evidence, you texting Millie Molly Brown whenever she's 17, you know, that kind of stuff. The question I have to ask you, putting hot sauce in your condoms, that's 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 a gangster move right there, man. I have to ask you, Drake, why? Why would you... I don't understand. Maybe because I'm not famous. Maybe because I'm not rich. But I don't, seem, I don't understand why rich and famous people go after minors. It doesn't make any sense to me. Because in my eyes, the person, the, the fucking scumbag who would do that would be someone with no other options. Besides, like, manipulating someone. It's getting dark. Like, that's what I would see. It would have to be the biggest fucking asshole in the world. 
in my opinion, to go after those people. Now you can be defensive and say, oh, they re reach after him. Oh, they reach after him. But Drake is fucking one of the most famous people, rich people in the world. Not rich people in the world, but one of the most famous people in the world, right? In the music industry. And you should have, being that big, the self-control and the self-fucking confidence and the self-respect in yourself to not go after anyone under the age, in my opinion, as Drake being in his 30s under 20. I don't care that 18, 19, under 20, dude. That's, that's how I feel as a person. Like I'm, I'm 22 and I feel fucking weird if I like try to talk to an 18 year old, you know, like maybe I'm, maybe that's just me, but like, I don't understand this. Drake, you're in a position where majority of like, if you try to get a girl, you can probably get her because you are rich and famous, right? And I'm not throwing shots to women or anything, but, well, uh, why would you go out? Like, I don't know. Long story short, I don't understand that, Drake. Why are you doing that? You're a terrible fucking person. If you do, it's stupid. All right, do not go after fucking children. I don't think a fucking random Caucasian man should t tell you that in this fucking man cave, but don't go after fucking minors. And don't fucking try to be like, like a man, fucking DJ, whatever the fuck his name is, because he's saying, hey bro, the difference between a 17 year old and a 21 year old, there ain't that much of a difference, man. Yes, there is. Why do you want, why, just, just be fucking, have self-control, right? I know, I know maybe it's because they feel like they're invincible. Maybe they feel like they can get away with anything, but I don't understand that because you can literally get with any fucking girl you want to in reason, right? But you go after minors, which doesn't make any fucking sense. Anyway, Kendrick won the fucking battle, in my opinion. Kendrick fucking basically whipped the fucking floor with fucking and Drake. Drake got fucking shitted on. And plus, I do not like how Drake raps. He raps very fucking poorly, in my opinion. I'm spitting all over the place. But at the end of the day, I got a response to both of them. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna hit myself. I'm gonna hit you guys with the, my own fucking diss track of both Kendrick and fucking Drake. Right? Watch this. I'm, I'm about to win this fucking diss. Right? I'm about to in enter someone no one asked for. Enter this diss. Right? So uh, just a random person. Uh, give me on the B BBL Drizzy fucking mix. 